In this video, we'll look at how social annotation tools can be used to support researching in problem-based learning approaches. In the problem-based learning cycle, one of the most important steps is that learners gather and share knowledge. This step allows them to develop their own understanding in an inquiry-based approach. When students gather and share knowledge, they engage in productive research, they share this research with each other, either synchronously or asynchronously, and they discuss the information and the findings, both synchronously and asynchronously. Let's experiment with how you might use a social annotation tool like Hypothesis to facilitate the gathering of knowledge in the problem-based learning cycle. To use Hypothesis to support problem-based learning in the research stage, set up groups for learners to be able to participate and collaborate with social annotation together. Alternatively, learners can create their own groups to share with each other and with you as the educator. By opening up the individual group, you can see all of the annotations the learners have been working on, including the source where they have been drawing their research. You can see the title of the research that they're exploring and the quantity of annotations that appear there. Click through to explore what they are saying about each topic. You can also find tags that they are using to organize the research, along with a list of all of the members, and their individual contributions to the total annotations of the group. Learners can freely share their annotations with each other and with their colleagues by just sharing the link to access the group. On an individual document or individual research piece, you can easily filter by each group and see what students are saying about this particular topic within that group. You can monitor their conversations and offer feedback and comments to support learners.